Like, oh, I'm so annoyed. like 9 45 on thursday today's the 19th i believe yesterday was my friday so i only worked monday tuesday oh let me bring my bag gotta go to zara at some point today or tomorrow so i just want to have it in my car um i have a doctor's appointment right now that i'm about to go to about to be late to gotta get a mammo done yes a mammo um since i've had breast implants i try to get them i try I, not i try i get it done once a year so i'm a little bit late getting it done i'm probably about like three or four months behind but that's okay i'm getting it done so i just recommend everybody no matter your age to get that done whether you have breast implants you're natural whatever get it done because far too many women dying of breast cancer at young ages um they tell us you know we need to worry about it when we're like 40 50 no no ma'am start worrying about that shit when you're in your 20s because i know y'all have heard of girls dying of breast cancer in their 20s and 30s so Gotta get these titties smashed today. <laughs> I wanted to dress up cute today and just run all my errands like while I'm out now. But um, I'm literally wearing like pajamas. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, I'm running late. Oh Lord, I'm, I'm gonna be like 10 minutes late um what else i have an appointment later today for my toe focus for my toe i told y'all that it felt like the um toe infection was coming back and i was in very mild pain and discomfort for like three days but now it's been gone for about three days so I'm thinking I should still just go ahead and go. Um, my appointments for later on today, later on this afternoon. <sighs> I think, whoa. I'm thinking I just need to go ahead and go. Even though I don't wanna have to pay that copay for them to just say, oh, it's nothing wrong, it went away, it's healed. <sighs> but still, I'd, I'm one of those, like I'd rather know than not know. Maybe it's just laying dormant right now. Maybe it's there. I'm just not feeling anything. I don't know. Shoot. But um, I definitely want to get this toe right. I'm ready to get pedicures again. I'm ready to show my toes with confidence again. But yeah, so that's the that's what's going on right now. That's what I have to do. Two doctor's appointments. I need to run to the mall at some point. And I need to go buy some hangers. So, hello. So I either need to go to Walmart or Target later, or even the dollar store. I just need some plastic hangers. So I'm low key mad. Um, I'm leaving out the building. I arrived 15 minutes late, exactly 15 minutes late. They're telling me I'm over 15 minutes late. They said I was supposed to arrive 30 minutes early, which I was never told when I made my appointment and I asked them, arrive 30 minutes early for what for paperwork because i'm already in your system this isn't my first time getting this done they were like yes paperwork i'm like so why set an appointment for 9 45 or 9 30 whatever it is and we have to come 30 minutes early that's not our appointment time clearly anyway she said i was supposed to arrive at 9 15 so she rescheduled me she's saying i'm supposed to arrive at 9 15 my appointment was for 9.45. I was checking in right at 10 a.m. So, I don't know. I've never had 
an appointment canceled after being 15 minutes late. So they rescheduled me for two weeks, which sucks. And on this damn paper, that's stupid. Why put 9 a.m. on the paper when I have to be here at 8.30? Or else y'all are going to cancel my appointment. Like, <sighs> so annoying. Anyway, whatever. That's fine. Um, uh, so what am I going to go do now? <laughs> I don't know. I guess I'll go home and change, take a shower, change. I want to run to the jewelry store also. Ugh. I don't know. I'm frustrated. Let me figure this thing out and I'll pick y'all back up in a minute. So y'all, I just did a CVS deal. I'm sorry y'all, by the time this video comes out, this deal will be gone because I think it ends on the 21st and today's the 19th. But you can follow uh, One Cute Couponer on here on YouTube. She posts the videos in real time. So she'll do a deal and then she'll immediately get in her car and post it. Um, so follow her, One Cute Couponer, on YouTube and on Instagram. All of her deals are in real time. So let me show y'all what I got. The deal was you buy three um, Colgate toothpaste. And there is a $5 off coupon online. There's also a $3 off online. And so that only prompts you to pay like $4 and some change. And then it gives you a $5 um, thing back. Let me show my face. I think y'all will like that better. So it gives you a five, it pr prints you out a $5 reward back. So I paid, uh-oh, I think I threw that receipt away. Oops. I paid $4. 487 487 out of pocket for those three it gave me a five dollar coupon back then these toilet papers right here and these are like pretty good size these are 4.99 each and they're buy one get one free so i got two packs of the toilet paper for free because i used the five dollar um uh extra bucks that printed out with the toothpaste so I got three things, three uh, cases of toothpaste, two uh, cases of toilet paper, all for just four dollars and eighty cents. So, yeah, not too shabby. I think her deal she did like with nail polish too, because um, the five dollars she used it towards a nail polish deal where you like buy two nail polish, you get one free, and it prints off another five dollar thing. She uh did that. I don't need no nail polish. I don't need I don't need another bottle of nail polish ever in life. I have so much nail polish, I don't even use it because I'm always getting my nails done. And then if I need to like herb and polish my toes or something, then I um I'll just use the nail polish that I already have. But I don't need to coll just keep collecting nail polish just for the heck of it because it's free. I'm I'm not that type of person. I mean, I probably could have got it and put it like in a gift bag for Christmas for somebody. But um yeah, no. I didn't need that. So now let me go on fetch rewards, get my points, scan my receipts. And yeah, maybe I'll get some extra maybe some of these will prompt some extra points instead of the normal just 25 points what the fuck I just got a call right now from my foot doctor saying sorry but your insurance is out of network what I made this appointment a week ago y'all didn't think to check my insurance before that like I'm I'm just like I'm flabbergasted I'm I'm flabbergasted. What the fuck? Oh my god. If I had known my day was going to turn out like this, like I didn't have any appointments, I would have driven to the outlets. Like, I've been wanting to drive to the outlets for a long time. Like, I would have done that today. Like, oh, I'm so annoyed. <sighs> I'm so annoyed. All right, well, I'm pulling up in my neighborhood. I don't know what the hell I'm about to do. I might 
might just go out to lunch or something. I don't know. I have no clue. I'm annoyed and I don't want to be on camera annoyed. Y'all just got a PR package from Parade. They sent me these soft, soft panties. They, I wish y'all could feel them, how soft and silky they feel. They sent me some briefs, some high-waisted thongs, a hoodie. Y'all, this hoodie, I wish I could tell y'all the material. Like this material, it literally feels like a hoodie that would cost like $100. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait to wear this. And they sent me some tarot cards. How cool and cute. How cool and cute. And then some stickers. Y'all make sure y'all check out Parade. I do have a discount code if y'all want to go shopping. It is that damn Gina and I'll have it on the screen as well. But y'all make sure y'all check them out. I love this stuff. I'm gonna wear these panties to work on Monday. I don't wear panties on the weekend. I don't wear, if I'm not at work, I don't wear panties. I only wear panties when I go to work or when I wear jeans. Other than that, mm -mm, I don't wear them. But y'all check them out and use my coupon code. Okay, guys. It's been so much longer. I have literally just been wasting time. But let me show you my outfit. I'll post a picture of it, like the one that I post on the gram, so... If you follow me on Instagram, you would have already seen my outfit. <laughs> oh my God, I just dropped my camera. What the fuck? <laughs> anyway, it's just a Forever 21 outfit. I literally paid $4 for these sweats, 50 cents for this little tank top. Then this jacket I paid full price for is like $35. Then I got on my Gucci socks, Balenci shoes, and then my Louis bag. And then this little hat I got from like a little beauty supply store. So I'm about to go run my errands, probably go get something to eat, and then pick up the kids by 6 o'clock. Alright, I'm at the Hood Mall, what used to be called Sharpstown Mall, but now it's called Plaza America. I don't know why they tried to rename it, it's still the Hood Mall. Let's see, can y'all see? That's the jewelry center right there. So I'm about to walk in and see. I know they're not going to let me record. Like I just, I know it. I don't even think I'm going to try. But I might show y'all a little bit of clips. I'll probably get some clips on my phone. Y'all, look at my lunch at the mall. I didn't know they did half and half of the uh, starch. So I got rice, noodles, what's that, bourbon chicken, orange chicken, and an egg roll. Why was this shit $14? Please tell me why this is $14. The drink? It's $3. I'm asking them, like, why is that drink so expensive? Mm. Mm, 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 mm. I went to Zara to get my exchange, picked up my um, my online order. Y'all want to see me do um, Y'all want to do a mukbang? I was gonna talk to y'all while I eat, but I'm not going to because this shit is so good and I'm about to stuff my face. So I'll be right back. Okay, I'm done. This is literally three meals in one. Uh, my kids might be eating this for dinner. <laughs> it was so, so good. Three hours later. Oh my god, it's life changing. So late, I can't believe it. Thank you. you. He's only like three days left. Ooh. Oh, okay. You just like, me, so, me, me. In my lunch box, I got a soap, a body scrub, so who's gonna give me a hug? And a lotion. I've never had anything from Lush before. They're always. Very pricey. <laughs> so I've never shopped in there and I've always wanted to. Thank you, but aww. Yes, now let's yes, see yes. what's in the Bath and Body Works. Ooh. Yep. Okay. Pink velvet.
smell the good. Oh, that sounds like it smells good. At least they all smell really good. Sparkling peach sangria. Winterberry wonder. Ooh. Thank you, Byron. Of course, of course, of course. Hope, uh, hope you like all of them. I hope you all smell good. I thought they smelled pretty good. So, um, Byron, you don't need to be extra on I gotta get on high. Well, what do you do when you're on, Ashton? Huh? What do you do when you're on? And I like show what's happening. Mm -hmm. I show oh, like besides like fragrances and candles and stuff. Because the, because the, I went up there and the guy was like, get a candle. I was like, I got a candle like the past three times. I'm gonna get another candle. Oh, you can never have enough candles. Uh, no, because they burn quick. Like, really? yeah, a candle only lasts. I, I burn my candles every single day for hours. So I mean, my candles only last like a week, week and a half. I didn't know that. Yep. I mean, still, I want to get you something mm. different. I didn't want to get your candles each time. No, I the, appreciate it. Definitely it changing it up. But like, besides that stuff, what do you like? Uh, you can never go wrong with gift cards. So I can just... Tell you? Alright, how you want your hair, baby? Bye! A bun? With the little curls at your ears? Mm -hmm. All right, your wish is my command. <laughs> All done. She requested a bun and curls. You are beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> All right, you can go finish getting ready. Okay. Just dropped the kids with their dad. Um, I'm headed, it's 1.30. I'm about to head home now. I'm trying to see if me and my sister are gonna do Sunday fun day or if I'm just gonna meet my friends and go get something to eat, I'm not really sure. Need to know a sappity sap. Oh God, I hate these voice text messages. I really do. You know why I hate them so much? Because if you're listening to it and it's kind of long and then your screen goes black, you can't pick up from where you left off. You have to start from the freaking beginning. That shit is like so stupid to me. Like all these updates Apple does, like y'all can't, y'all couldn't have had that to be an update to where I can fast forward, rewind, talk. Why? I already know what's gonna happen. I already know. I'm gonna get home, nobody's gonna wanna do anything and I'm just gonna be sitting in the house like I did all day yesterday. <laughs> I feel it, I feel it in my bones, which I'm cool with cause I mean, I gotta work in the morning anyway, so. Y'all, I'm so excited. I go get my teeth done in two weeks. Two weeks, 15 days. I'm excited. I just hope they turn out how I want them to. I need to call my tattoo guy because it looks like my tattoo didn't take good like over top of the scar. I need to send pictures and call him and let him know like around the scar where it's tattooed is perfectly fine but like just right on that strip it's kind of like the color it didn't take very good so i need to see if he can like go over it one more time to just put a little bit more color in and hopefully that'll help so i need to do that today because it's already been i think i got this tattoo what like two weeks ago three weeks ago so what's up y'all it's like a few hours later I just threw this wig on, threw a little outfit on. I'm about to go meet one of my friends at Fleming Steakhouse. I've never been there before, so we're just gonna go get something to eat. Um, then I'm gonna go pick up my kids a little bit later on, probably around like 7 p.m. Uh, or I might just get them earlier since I'm already gonna be out after eating. Uh, I ain't wanna put on no makeup. So y'all know, the bang. The Bayang wig does its job when you don't want to wear makeup, so. Yep, and then I have on just this little Zara crop top, these Forever 21 jeans, some clear slides that I got from Shein, and then I'm gonna wear my Prada bag, and see which watch I wanna wear.
these are my two watches that I got for my birthday, the AP, and then I got the Ice Dot Rolex. I don't know if I showed y'all this one. I got the Ice Dot Rolex. Um, I'm probably going to wear this one. Yeah. Okay, so I'm already running a little bit late. I'm already running a little bit late, so I really need to hurry up. My waist is not looking as snatched. I know somebody's gonna say, yes it is. No, it's not looking as snatched. Like, I feel like I'm starting to get a little back rolls and everything. But it's all good, that's what quarantine does. It makes you a little bit more fluffy. It's all good. <laughs> I style roller on me. Okay, let me find some silver earrings. Or I might wear my like studded, the little studded earrings. Let me see, I really don't have it. Okay, I might wear these. I've had these forever. Just some Forever 21 earrings. I think I bought these like, probably like a good like five months ago. I'm talking about forever. Not, not, not forever, but it's been like a good five months. I think I'm gonna put these on, change my purse. Oh, I also have these. I think I bought these the same day. I think I bought these the same day. These are like some chain silver earrings. Maybe these will look better because they're a little bit bigger. We'll see. All right, this is how we looking. <laughs> I did change my watch. I put on the AP instead just because uh, I needed to. <laughs> I'm gonna leave it at that. So I'm wearing the AP instead, even though the Rolex goes better. And yeah, let's see which fragrance your girl's gonna wear today. I'm gonna do Prada Candy. Prada Candy. I think it's gonna go good with this um with the part with the lotion that I'm wearing. So yeah. Right. Damn, I made my shirt wet. Shit. I hope that dries clear. God damn. That's some bullshit. Okay. Anyway. Okay. I need a silver neck. I need to get me a chain made. Like, I need a name. Bust down chain made. Y'all see my balloons? They still holding on. It's been over a week. I'm actually, for my name, for my uh, necklace, I'm actually gonna wait <laughs> to see what I'm gonna get for Christmas. Because y'all see I got both watches for my birthday. So I'm gonna see, I'm gonna see what Christmas is talking about. And then I'll make my decision if I'm going to get it myself, if I don't get it as a gift. All right, I got, a video uploading on the computer. Got my phone, got my keys. Oh, let me close some of these blinds. Do I got a mask? Yeah, I got mask. <gasps> oh, excuse me. I got masks in the car. Y'all, I dyed a few pair of jeans with this writ black dye i used like half of the packet that was in there and i dyed a pair of jeans for myself and two pairs for ashton and i want to see these look the exact same hold on am i tripping like these don't look These really don't look any darker in my opinion. Let me put them in the dryer. Actually, my jeans look a little bit darker. These look darker. Ashton's jeans really don't. But let me put them in the dryer and see before I just start tripping. Well, I already know how you like it. Take you to the mall and get you a new outfit. You make me delirious. Two hours later. <gasps> Do I have 
stains? What the fuck? What is Stained my shirt. What the fuck? I didn't even notice. I've been in the restaurant the whole time I ate. Wow. Y'all, this perfume stains come out. I paid $20 from this shirt from Zara. It's my first time wearing it. Like, whoa. That sucks. I'm about to go home and try to wash it. What the fuck? Damn, that sucks. Anyway, um, so yeah, I went, ate at Fleming's, had a steak, had some, started with some shrimp cocktail, then I had a ribeye steak, some al gratin potatoes and onion rings. Ribeye steaks, I noticed, that's, that's my steak, is a ribeye. Um, filet mignon, I am not a fan of. New York strip I'm not a fan of I've never had a tomahawk um what else yeah ribeye is just so it's juicy and flavorful I get it cooked either medium or medium well and it's so good so that one it had a little bit more pepper on it than I would have liked but um their food is good their onion rings with that jalapeno dip was like magnificent so now I think I'm about to go home and change clothes, obviously, and go meet with my sister. She wants to do like a little, not really Sunday fun day because, I mean, it's 5.30. So Sunday fun day is usually starts around, what, 1 o'clock? <laughs> um, so, but she wants to go to like this little daytime spot. So I think I'm going to change clothes real quick. Might put on just a little bit of makeup and then meet her out. And then try to be back at home for 10 10 30. So, yeah that's what I do since I don't have to pick up my kids tonight. So their dad just called not that long ago and said I ain't gotta get them baby. I'm like oh I got a free night? Okay. <laughs> not really. I mean it's really not that free of a night because I still gotta be up early for work in the morning so I really can't just just do what I want. So I'm going to try to be home for about 10.30, 11 at the very latest. So I need me at least six hours of sleep to be able to function and be in a good mood and smiling in people's faces. So that's what I'm going to do. I am so mad about this damn shirt. What the? I don't, what is it? Like, I always spray my perfume on my clothes and this has never happened. I, at least I can't remember this ever happening. Maybe Prada Candy has oil in it. The fuck? I'm about to get on YouTube and or Google and see what takes out perfume stains. Okay, let's see how these jeans look. really tell a difference in my jeans let me say that there's some um high-rise Joni jeans they took the color really well the kids jeans not really not so much I mean they're not any worse I would say these jeans are Ashton's forever 21 jeans they might be like 10% better here's a pair of Ethan's Levi's they're a little bit better but um all in all, it's a, my jeans, it took it really well. So maybe I should have used the whole pack and not just half. So. All right, so it's heavy trash day tomorrow. Heavy trash day is only once every four weeks, every fourth Monday. So I'm about to try to take a little bit of this stuff out. Definitely not all of it because I'm not gonna be able to carry it. I was supposed to book a task rabbit job and I totally forgot. So I'm gonna take a little bit of it out and then um, I guess save the rest for next month. Kind of sucks. Oh my god, y'all. 
I hate that I already told my sister I will meet her out because I do not feel like getting dressed, putting on makeup, nothing. Oh my goodness. Oh, I don't feel like doing nothing. I really wish I could just snap my fingers and be ready. I'm not tired. I just don't feel like getting ready. Like, I don't feel like getting ready. I don't feel like driving there, looking for parking. I'm going to have to stop and pull some cash out. <sighs> oh, my goodness. Maybe I need to make myself a drink, put on some music. Okay, y'all, this is the fit. A little black Reb Dolls dress. My Alexander McQueen sneakers. I don't know if y'all can see them. Um, my Prada bag, it's the crossbody bag, but I just took the crossbody strap off and put the little pouch attached to the chain. And then this little white bucket hat. I don't know if I should wear this white bucket hat or if I should wear my Prada bucket hat. It seems like the white kind of brings out the white right here and then the white in the sneakers. Let me show y'all. Okay, so this is how it looks with the white hat. You see I got the white and black McQueen sneakers on with the bag I don't know if this white hat looks too like springy like too much beachy summery let me show you how the black hat okay so this is it with the black hat the bag uh, I don't know I wish I had somebody to give me a second opinion I think I'm gonna do the black hat just because it's nighttime but I still think the white hat goes better. I just think it looks too daytimey. I don't know. Maybe I'm tripping. Maybe I'm crazy. y'all so i'm leaving the first spot about to go to the second spot it is 9 30. i got about another good hour in me really i got about another good like two to three hours in me but i gotta get up for work in the morning so that kind of cuts my time down where we're going 50 15. <sighs> bar 50 15 let me see how far it is from here oh eight minutes. let's take hamilton street houston Arrival time on this route is similar to Jackson Street, Houston. Okay. So I had, how many drinks did I have? I had a shot, a drink, a drink. So I had one and a half drinks and one shot. That's it. So that's what I'm driving off of right now. Um, let me go this way. So when I get to the next spot, one drink limit one drink or one shot limit that is it i gotta be able to drive home go to sleep wake up function and be a good employee at 7 a.m so turn right on polk street so that's the plan i said turn right okay i'm gonna pick y'all back up when we get to the other spot I'm a real ass, rich ass bitch from the south. All right, just made it to the other spot. Paid 20 for parking, which I freaking hate, but I know I'm not going to pay for any drinks, so I got to kind of look at it as like a give and take. So I'm trying to see where my sister is. She said, okay. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. One more drink and that's my limit, y'all. That is my limit. Just made it home. Took my dress off. I ain't take my hat and my wig off yet, but y'all. 
What time is it? It's 11.25. I gotta be up at 5.30. I've had about three, four drinks. I'm about to go. I'm about to end the vlog here. I love you guys. I will see y'all in the next one. Peace.